Diwali, Deepavali. The festival of lights is just around the corner and hope you're on a festive mood to celebrate this authentic festival. Even I am so excited. The whole India celebrates Diwali. Even the people settled in other countries celebrate this day as a grand festival. Yeah, what's new in this? Nothing new. Everyone knows about Diwali and the reasons and stories behind the festival. Still, a brief introduction. Diwali is a Hindu festival celebrated across India. There are many stories behind the celebrations of Diwali. Some believe that it is the festival to commemorate the victory of Rama over Ravana. And some believe that it is a celebration of the triumph of Lord Krishna over Asura Narasura. But there is a common theme behind these spiritual stories. It is the festival that symbolizes victory of good over evil, or knowledge over ignorance, or light over darkness. Well, many knew this, so I don't want to elaborate further. What I love about this festival is the festival zest that begins even before a week. People throng into the shopping malls and the big clothing stores and the busiest streets will come into life. You can see hundreds of instant small clothes and sweet stores that suddenly popped up on the roads. And you can witness vendors on both the sides of streets selling clothes and attires. And you can see thousands of new customers with big smiles on faces everywhere. Kids run here and there even to buy whatever they see. I love hearing the cute arguments between the parents and the children and the bargains between the vendors and customers. Because at the end of the day, everyone will win. That's the beauty of this festival. And in our homes, elders start preparing sweets and savouries a week before the festival. One could smell the aroma of ghee and oil throughout the area. And if you are a child, you may get the privilege to taste the sweets and savouries even before they offer to go. Actually, people in other parts of India used to light mud lamps and decorate their home with mud lamps on this auspicious day. People in Tamil Nadu celebrate this festival by lighting the crackers. In Tamil Nadu, on the Diwali day, we used to get up early in the morning. Elders in the family used to apply oil on the heads of their family members, keep nalanga and bless them. Everyone will use sihakai pudi instead of shampoos and soap. It's a traditional practice and everyone follows it. And then we burst crackers and distribute sweets to the near and dear ones. And the children used to light flower pots, matap, sparklers, ground fireballs and the night dark sky will be filled with colorful fireworks. Now while recording this, people in our streets were enjoying and you can hear the crackers sound in the background. Diwali mostly occurs in the mid of October number, which will also be the beginning of the rainy seasons. So all I can pray is, let the Lord Varuna, rain god, stops raining and shows some mercy on these vendors at least today, so that the vendors may return home with empty goods and customers with bag full of clothes and sweets and may everyone celebrate Diwali with happiness and joy. Wish you all a very happy Diwali. So, that's all for today. I'll meet you with some other interesting information in my next video. Until then, bye, take care and have a pleasant day.